Chapter 5, beginning, let's go. In the countryside versus in Tokyo. The curses differ in level. Alright, so it looks like she's found her first curse. Kusika, Kugisaki's first strike against the curse disguised as a mannequin. A series of unfortunate events unfold during the practical test. <laughs> the nails. It's best if you take them out. Okay. So the nails are still in the mannequin. Because my magical power flows in them. Okay, so it looks like she's destroyed. It's settled. So it's like bonk. There's a kid. A kid. He probably crept in to play and a curse. Hey, it's okay now. Come here. Okay, so he's like, eh? I guess the saying that children don't get emotionally attached to beautiful people is true. What an inconsiderate, what an inconsiderate woman I am. I'll call you Itadori. Wait. Don't leave me here. So there's a creature there. It's like, huh? So you got some oozing. She's like, huh? He's taking him hostage. This curse has intelligence. Although I say level, it's not just about the about the amount of magical power. Slyness. Beasts with intelligence sometimes confront us with a cruel scale. A scale that pits one life against another. Okay? So shit 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 shit. Even though this kind of curse is practically nothing, grade four or at best the lowest of grade three. And it's aware of its own grade. That's the reason for its hostage strategy. Okay. Calm down. If I die, that kid will also die. But if that kid dies, I won't die. Think about this rationally. Should I at least try to save myself, right? Okay, so she's dropping her hammer and nail. I'm unarmed. Let that kid go. I'm an idiot. See? I won't let him go. I wanted to see Sayori for the last time. Okay, so it looks like he's going through. Oh, and now we got um, our main guy, he's come through. Igami? No, no. Anyway, no, no. Huh? He got detached? Dude, he spikes through the wall. It's like, huh? And he got the knife, to, he's cut the hand off. He saved a kid. Are you okay? Ah, he escaped. I won't let you escape. All right, so she's got like a, a voodoo doll. Itadori, hand over that arm. Okay. So you, oh, oh, he decides it. Wait. Okay. A straw doll. Straw doll ritual. How wicked. Resonance. So she's like, whack. She's put the nail through it. It's like, ugh, ah. So he's got the nail through him. All right, nice. She really is crazy. All right, so it looks like she's passed. When I was in the first grade, Sayori moved to the village from Tokyo. Sayori was as cute as a doll and as kind as Virgin Mary. Cute and kind Say Sayori was ostracized by the villagers. Okay, she thinks country people are stupid. Our persecution complex, complex inflated on its own and we pushed her away. I felt... Impossibly bad. Sorry, made made for me sweets I'd never even heard of. While joking that the ones sold in the shop taste even excuse me, taste even better. That's why I told you it's dangerous on your own, and to do this seriously. You didn't say it's dangerous on your own. I I didn't say that. Okay. What kind of food did you eat in your childhood so you could smash the walls down with your bare hands? It wasn't still reinforced concrete. Even if it's not still reinforced concrete, it should be impossible. I've been asked about it plenty of times too, but why did you come to the Magic Technical College? Okay. It's because I hated the countryside and wanted to live in Tokyo. Alright, <laughs> so she just wanted to live in the city. It's like, eh? The only way to come to Tokyo without worrying about money was to do this. You'd risk your life for a reason like that? I would. That's why I'm me. Okay. If I'd stayed in the village, I'd be as good as dead. Sayori, I came to Tokyo. 
Take me to that shop you talked about when we meet again, okay? I'm thankful to you too. Whether I died or survived alone, I wouldn't have had a, have had a bright future. Thank you. He's like, huh? Well, I guess having a heavier reason doesn't necessarily make you more admirable. Whatever. I thank you so I don't owe you anything. We're even. What's with her? Good work, guys. <laughs> He's like, yeah. The kid was at school at home. Let's go eat this time. Beef thing, Sushi. <laughs> so, so, what's wrong, Fushigura? Nothing. Are you sorry because you didn't get your turn? Oh, what a kid. <laughs> Alright. So something's gone. Uh, record July 28, 2018. Nishi Tokyo City. Issue reform school above the field. Okay. Hey, what the hell is that? What? That. It looks like an egg. So what? Okay. Uh... Itadori and Kurisaki willingly became students of the Magic Technical School. However, what awaits them is... Okay, it looks like it's an embryo. A potentially high-grade, vengeful ghost. Name undecided. Several non-shamans were confirmed to have sighted the cursed womb. Due to the urgency of the situation, the three first-year students from the Magic College were dispatched. Within that group, one is dead. Ooh, alright. We might lose someone already. I doubt that. I don't see that actually happening. Hmm. Alright, so that is the end of chapter 5, guys. And we're going to move into chapter 6, The Cursed Womb's Earthly Existence.